today I'm going to make my DIY helical antenna and this old uh, glass jar little like screw on lid which is made of metal will be the reflector for the helical antenna. I went to Home Depot and picked up this 12 gauge copper wire and it's about 25 cents a foot and then to actually connect the antenna to my goggles, I bought this male to male SMA to SMA connector. So this way I can just cut this connector in half and then I can have two antennas. I don't have to solder the individual connectors and the cable is also included. So that's my tip for saving money. I already 3D printed both of these um, shapers and formers. And this is the cage for the wire. And I just ended up wrapping the copper wire around this little coiled former. And then you can just cut that off, unscrew this, and then just screw it on, screw the copper wire coil onto this cage. So after making the seven turn uh, helical antenna, I decided to make this five turn one just to get a little bit of a broader signal reception. The pasta sauce lid, I wasn't really sure if it would work nicely. So I, I cut this one out of steel. It took me quite a long time, but I used some snips and a a nice file to get it down to a nice round shape. I printed out a template and stuck it on here. That's why it's a little bit dirty. I drilled the holes. So now I'm going to solder this coaxial cable with the SMA connector onto this steel plate. This seven turn antenna is the one that I filmed mostly of. And this is a smaller five turn one. This five turn one, I actually believe performs a little bit better just due to the flatness of the reflector. This is the test vehicle that I'll be using to test the range of my custom helical antennas. It just has a little Eshin TX05 all-in-one um, video transmitter and camera that outputs about 250 milliwatts and I'm using a wing flight controller just to get an OSD overlay and the ability to use a GPS. This way I can find the total range that this car can go before the video signal cuts out. I will run some video tests. See, I can see like distance from home and stuff. I'll first run some video tests using just Antenna A, the five turn one, just antenna B, the seven turn one, and then I'll also do diversity. <laughs> 